the modern day Maharaja. It's the WWE Champion. And you didn't think they were going to do this. You think it's a bad decision. You want to know why you think this is a bad decision? It's because you're hindering gender. I don't know how many times we have to tell you, don't hinder gender. What's up, X3 Club? It's me, X3. And last night at Backlash, Jinder Bahal beat Randy Orton for the World Heavyweight Championship. I mean, it's like... We we didn't necessarily see this coming because you, you'll be like, nah, WWE is going to do it. But they did it. WWE did it. They pulled the trigger on Mahal as champion. And a lot of people are not happy about this. I'm pretty excited about this. You want to know why? Because I don't cry about everything that happens in WWE. Okay, look, Jinder Mahal is not that bad, all right? Just just hear me out here. He may work stiff sometimes, okay? He may he may have given Finn Balor a minor concussion. You know, things like that happen, okay? I'm I don't want to defend I'm not defending him taking Finn's head off, but you know, it's it's really unsafe in the ring sometimes and things happen. But he's not bad, okay? He's not a bad wrestler. He's not bad on the mic. But we, as WWE fans, are conditioned to think of Jinder Mahal as 3MB Jinder Mahal and not the modern-day Maharaja Jinder Mahal. We, it's, there's two, it's two different things, okay? That's like, you, you're not taking him as serious as you should, but that's really WWE's fault because of the 3MB situation from years ago. Here's why I think it's a good idea that he's champion right now, because it's something new. Like, Randy Orton's reign was really stale and boring. Randy Orton is just boring at this point. Jinder Mahal is new, well he's not, I wouldn't say new, but it's something new that he's champion and I'm kind of curious to see where they're gonna go with this. But I think I know where they're gonna go with this and it rhymes with smash him, do Zev. We all know Rusev is coming back soon and he wants his title match. And he's gonna get it against Jinder Mahal at Money in the Bank, which is fantastic because Rusev is honestly one of the most underrated superstars on the roster today. Okay, people, people do not appreciate handsome Rusev as much as I do. All right, he he deserves the title. Now, I would love to see handsome Rusev versus Hard Body Mahal at Money in the Bank, and that's what we're basically gonna get. But remember, it's Money in the Bank, so. If someone were to win the Money in the Bank briefcase, we might not even have Jinder Mahal as champion or Hanson Rusev as champion. We might have Baron Corbin, Sami Zayn, someone to win the, the whoever wins the briefcase could be champion that night. So it's really not all that bad. Money in the Bank is not that far away, okay? Just calm down. It's, it's going to be okay, really. I think this title run is a great way to establish Jinder Mahal as like one of SmackDown's top heels. I mean, the dude is already getting heat already for like no reason. He's only getting heat because he's Jinder Mahal. He was from 3MB. Like, 3MB, three-man band, the job squad. That's the only reason why he's really getting heat right now. It's, 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 there's no other, like, look. Former 3MB member Jinder Mahal is now WWE Champion. Former 3MB member Heath Slater went on to win the tag team titles. Former 3MB member Drew McIntyre is NXT, and he's probably about to win the NXT title. I mean, look, I may be reaching here, but 3MB, they're on the Shield's left. <laughs> I can't say that with a straight, no, it, never mind. All I'm saying is give Jinder Mahal a chance. Real, just just give it a chance. It happened last night. Calm down. We still have long ways to go in this, all right? They're not about to give this man a seven-year title run. They're not about to give this man, like, a whole year title run. Like, they're about to do Brock. Oh, <laughs> call, call, call. We want that. What we're about to get is, like, a month to two months, three months max. It will be fine. Give gender a chance. Just... Don't hinder gender. Well, that's all the time I have for this video. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already. Comment down below your thoughts on this video or your thoughts on Jinder Mahal winning the WWE Championship, whether it was a good idea or a bad idea. I'd love to hear your thoughts. If you want to see more videos like this on my channel, please hit that bell icon next to the subscribe button so you won't miss a video ever again. And don't hesitate to let me know what you want to see on my channel next. Share this video with your friends. Share it with your family. Share it on Twitter. Share it on Facebook. Share it everywhere. Help my channel grow. Help me grow. It makes me feel good. It motivates me to make more videos like this in the future. I have a little sub goal. I would like to reach just three, like just 300, 300 subs. It's, it's, it's just something special to me. And, and I, I have a goal, and I want to reach that goal. And I need your help reaching that goal.
Well, with that being said, I'm XG for the XG Club, telling you guys to eat garlic bread and respect women.